we were just this sort of very small group of filmmakers who went off to make a little movie. And the fact that it's now become something that's a franchise, I wouldn't have done it if David Gordon Green hadn't written a really compelling, very interesting take on it. And uh, it's just amazing. Uh, and can you tell us a little bit about your role in the new Death Race movie? Yeah, uh, Death Race Beyond Anarchy, I play a guy named Connor Gibson, um, who's uh, who, who, who gets brought in. Oh yeah, there's some, there's some stranger things about you. Um, uh, I love that dude, he's awesome. <laughs> I'm actually pretty chill when it comes to scary stuff. I mean, if, if you were putting me in like an actual haunted house, get me out. No, I'm not dealing with that. Is there a particular scene that you're looking forward to experiencing in the maze? I'm terrified by everything, so I think anything they draw from the film potentially could be good. Clown dolls, trees, closets, anything that's like terrified me in the movie, I'm ready to be experiencing. Everybody's asking, like, when's Trick or Treat 2 coming out? And I'm not going to necessarily ask that, but I did. Someday will it come out? It's up to Legendary at this point. If, if, if people that. really want a sequel, they should write letters to Legendary. What are you looking forward to experiencing the most in the Trick or Treat meet? Um, some flashbacks, maybe. It'd be like, oh, hey there, you're me. <laughs> I'm a really big scaredy cat but I've done a couple horror projects now. I did American Horror Story and I did Unfriended Now, and so I'm like, okay, I feel like I owe it to the genre to come do a Horror Nights. Now, have you both ever been to Halloween Horror Nights? I, I, here's my confession. I come every year, but it's to drop off my kids. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Uh, I come every year and I drag my kids with me. <laughs> Do you think that a whole new lineage will begin now, now that it's all been wiped out and now that he's not the brother anymore? Are you going to start a whole new lineage? You're already asking me about the next one? <laughs> of course! It really comes down to how, how the fans react and if there's still a really strong appetite because I do feel that there are fantastic characters in this new one and we could explore all kinds of things and uh, yeah, I'd, I'd be the first one to say yes, I hope so. It's hard to take something that you love so much and give it your own spin and then put it out there and go, here, everybody love this, you know. Uh, but now is the night where the doors open and people get to check it out and hopefully they like it. <laughs> <laughs>